Psst, disclaimer. Hmm. No. Can you stop being so distracting? I'm just sitting here. Handsomely? Well, good evening, Lotties, Lasses, and Lassos. I'm sitting here in my studio and the light is broken, so it's really dark. But you know, that is fine, because the only light I need in my life is you. Welcome to r slash wholesome memes. Enjoy. My best friend and me, 10 years ago and now. Yum yum woof. Oh, that is so cute. I love pictures like this. And it also makes you appreciate the great things in life. And save pictures, because you don't realize it from day to day, because everybody ages so slowly. When you have gradually been making healthy changes, and you begin to notice you're no longer depressed. Hmm, worked out quite nicely. Hmm. When you and your boy take different paths in life, but still love each other. Aw, that is so sweet. How are you doing mentally? A little better. I ate lunch. That's a good first step, fam. If you're feeling down, the, the easiest way is just to do something. You know, it doesn't have to be a big thing. It doesn't have to be a big step. You don't have to change the world. Just do a little something. Go for a walk. Eat something you find tasty. Um, talk to a good friend. Just the small things really do help sometimes. Self-love is making a home-cooked meal. Seeing a friend. Hiya, possum. Enjoying a hobby. Nice attack, Kiwi. Asking for help. Dr. Pigeon, therapist. That is true, fam. Everybody watching this video, make sure to take care of yourself. Even if help doesn't always mean that you have to go to the doctor, sometimes just talking to a good friend or going outside or doing something because we have a tendency to make problems bigger than they really are. I know I do that often and I know plenty of people that do too. And just showing yourself that life goes on outside those problems usually means a lot for your mental state. For example, when my channel got taken down, I, I was just like, I'm not gonna leave my room until this is solved, which is ter ter terribly toxic. And you know, it lasted for almost three weeks, so I would have starved, <laughs> literally. <laughs> um, but as soon as I went outside, I started talking to my friends. I hung out with my girlfriend and family. I mean, it all felt better because you realize the rest of your life is still going. That's the, that's the advice I can give anyone going through a hard time. Tiredness, problems at work, stress. Six-year-old me asking my dad to play with me. My dad. Aww, that is so sweet. And it's so true, honestly. It's like all the worries in the world kind of go away and you're just sitting in your bubble, enjoying time with people you love. Rediscovering nature after spending years depressed in your room. Huh, this is like me after spending a solid 12 hours editing a Noah Get the Boat video. <laughs> just going out sitting in a water puddle in the middle of the bush like... Ah, oh yes, <laughs> clear my mind. Do you need more water? He's a cactus. I don't think he needs much water. Hmm, even if it doesn't need much, we should still ask our low-maintenance friends if they're okay. That's very true. You know that super introverted friend you have? Still ask them about once every second month if they want to hang out and have a beer. You know, they really do appreciate it. <laughs> when a random stranger asks me to watch their stuff with them, I'm doing my part. Let's take it slow. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> ah, that is so adorably cute. Oh. You know, fam, if you're building things that are going to last, there's no point in rushing it. And take your time and make sure that everybody involved is comfortable and know what they're doing. And if you feel like you're energized by the relationship, you're in a very good place. How to win an introvert's heart. One, buy them food. Two, tell them they're beautiful. Three, leave. And then repeat once every three months or so. <laughs> Very best friend who lives a thousand miles away and having a really hard time lately. Me, surprising her for a birthday in nine days. Hello, hello there. Don't do that though. Just hanging outside the window in the middle of the night like, ah, happy birthday. <laughs> but why are you just floating here? Hey. Oh, wow. Aw. That's so cute, because the shark would usually eat the fish, but they're kind of just chilling out together watching the night sky. A 112-year-old man, just one year and he's a teenager again. The return of the king! <laughs> oh my god! When you get a date for the first time ever. <laughs> if I could look that cute on a first date, oh my god. Hmm. Sometimes it's okay if the only thing you did today is sleep. Don't be stressed about taking it easy sometimes. I found personally that I almost always need to accomplish something to properly relax or like enjoy a video game or a movie or something like that. But 
it is okay to relax. Everybody needs to switch off. When you find a family photo that brightens your day and brings you back to good memories. Woof woof! All the woofers in one place. So much soft cuddles. Yay! My love for you is like a Windows update. A Windows update? Yeah! It goes on forever. Aww! So sweet! Look at them because they're computers! Bernie! Every man can cry and it's okay. What I usually do myself, that's kind of my own philosophy, people have different ways of tackling it. I tend to have a few people that I'm really comfortable with and I really trust that I am willing to share pretty much everything with. I don't necessarily show that much negative emotion in public, for example, but it's always important to have at least a few people in your life that you feel that you can be vulnerable with. And that's perfectly fine, and that's what everyone does, and it's healthy. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Are you okay? <laughs> Fall in love with someone that you can be vulnerable with. Since it's the 80th anniversary of Tom and Jerry, can we appreciate how great of a dad Spike was? Aw, come here, buddy. Aw, oh, no, it's so sweet. This is so good. After making Noah get the boat and insane parents, this really vitalizes my faith in the human race. Yeah, single moms are cool, but let's take a minute to recognize the single fathers who so often go unrecognized. Good job, guys. Keep up the good work. Oh, that is so wholesome. I know a single father, <clears throat> and if you're watching this, man, you know who you are. You're an amazing person. Love you, man. Mwah. When it's 2005 and your homie gives you all of his handwritten GTA San Andreas cheat codes. <gasps> I remember that back in the day. Oh, we used to do that with like every video game under the sun. And it was so funny because you didn't have internet, you couldn't search for stuff, everything was kind of like rumors. It's like, if you beat this level on 100% within 32 minutes, you get this secret. And nobody really knew for sure. And most of the time it was like someone's big brother was messing with someone at some point. <laughs> Men can have a mental illness, have an eating disorder, have an addiction, feel insecure, be bullied, feel emotion, cry. When my depressed friends think they're a burden, so I drag them into the sunbeam of my affection. Me. <laughs> Uh, I just want to lie here, but it's so good. Mm. Grandparents, me, changing from HDMI 1 to HDMI 2. The withered, where? Nobody, the guy in the math problem. My, all my watermelons. A man walks in and buys 731 watermelons. Mm. Psst. Huh? More like extra cutioner. <laughs> One day, you'll see your kid for the last time. We'll see about that. Hmm. Later. Come on, son. We're going shopping. He's like, he's like 45. <laughs> <laughs> Me. My mental health. You awesome people. 14, 12, 19. 9, 2, 20. That is so beautiful. By the way, for context, this is in Australia, which is so beautiful. Australia, I have one question. How in the frick? A forest fire make the ground more fertile. It's nature's way of refreshing the plants. So all the carbon and stuff going into the ground is like refertilizing the nature. So it looks really good surprisingly fast. That is impressive. I really hope this isn't fake. <laughs> when you kill a mouse and bring it to the house so your human doesn't starve. It ain't much, but it's honest work. Meow. Extrovert that adopted me. Introvert me. Aww. Me, who didn't hit the boy. The boy, who didn't hit me either. Gender equality and pacifism. Oh, that is so true. It goes both ways. Everybody should be nice to everybody. That, that's, the, that's the best way of seeing it. Y'all y'all are beautiful. Remember this if you're sitting back home? Your feet smell great today. Okay, that was kind of kind of cursed. Y'all y'all beautiful. <laughs> Gen X, Gen Z, Boomer, Millennial. Watch Tom and Jerry. Aw, yeah. Me, praying for all my friends' crushes to accept them on Valentine's Day. They're ugly, but they need love too. <laughs> a relationship is, is it's based on many things. It's like the initial thing that you usually see is kind of like physical attraction. Uh, but after a while, it becomes so much more than that. Yeah. Huh? Bonk! <gasps> I'll try my best. It's important to love yourself, y'all. We sure messed up yesterday. Why are you so happy then? Because today we get to try again! We messed up today too. Because tomorrow we get to try again! <laughs> when you see your girl naked for the first time. <laughs> when you see your girl naked for the 236th time. <laughs> and I obviously look just as cute as that. When one act of kindness creates a lifelong friendship. 
I fixed a pigeon's wing, so he went to fetch his girlfriend, and now they live at my house. Oh, that is so wholesome. That's so cute. I hope they have baby pigeons as well that can hop around like in summertime. That would be so adorable. When you only have one item in line at the grocery store, and the person in front of you lets you go ahead of them. That was very cash money of you. Oh, that is so nice. I, I love when people do that. I try to do that myself too when I have way too much and buy like, Oh, you you behind me? I just have one carton of milk. Yeah, go. It will take like five seconds. It's, it's worse for you to wait for me than the other way around. <laughs> well, laddies, lasses and lassos, I do hope you feel good after watching this video. That is the intention. Other than that, you can check out my socials and Discord and all that stuff in the description. So I hope you have an amazing day, night time, or whatever time you see you later. And I will see you in the next video. Take care.